If you are looking for a more affordable alternative to SeaWorld San Diego, consider visiting Birch Aquarium. This attraction is located less than 15 miles north of downtown San Diego by La Jolla Shores. The aquarium was occupied in September of 1992 with the mission of providing ocean science education, interpreting scripts research, and promoting conservation. Before you enter Birch Aquarium, you need to snap a photo in front of the Legacy. It's a compilation of three life-size gray whale bronze statues. Two are breaching in one fountain pool, while the third one is tall up in a separate nearby pool. The Legacy marks the entrance to the aquarium. We are now in the ticket booth purchasing our tickets. Admission starts at around $25 for adults and $20 for children ages 3 to 17. The aquarium is open year round. Generally, it welcomes visitors daily from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Parking is free but be sure to check the aquarium's website for information when planning your visit. Here's a tank with Pacific sardines swimming rapidly in circles. It's pretty cool and such a wonderful sight to see before entering into the Hall of Fishes. This exhibit features more than 60 habitats. Guests will find tanks with colorful fishes. There are several highlights that you should not miss, such as the giant jellyfish and the two-story gallon tank called Giant Kelp Forest.
We are now heading over to Tide Pool Plaza. This stunning outdoor plaza overlooks the Pacific Ocean and it's perfect place to enjoy the outdoors. Tide Pool Plaza give kids the unique opportunity to touch local tide pool creatures like sea anemones, sea stars, and sea urchins. If we had to pick a favorite exhibit, this is it. Here you will find a dozen seahorse species, their relatives the sea dragon and the other unique fishes. Immerse yourself in the incredible world of seahorses and sea dragons and learn about how they care and conserve this unique fish. Sea dragons are delicate colorful and beautiful so i highly recommend that you stop by and check out this permanent exhibit The next exhibit is called Expedition at Sea. This exhibit showcases the ship's cutting edge research and what it's like to be out at sea. You will even have a chance to suit up like an explorer. now at a place called Blue Beach, which is the spot for guests and families to connect with the ocean and each other. This is also where Shark Shores exhibit is located. Shark Shores is a home to a few spectacular species you will find along the coast of Southern California. Discover different kinds of sharks and stingrays on this exhibit. Birch Aquarium is the only place on the west coast where you can find little blue penguins. Little blue penguins are the world's smallest penguins with less than 12 inches tall. In this exhibit, guests will learn about little blue penguins journey from hatchlings to adults, highlighting the challenges they face in a changing climate while celebrating the features that make these penguins so unique and adorable. 
The exhibit also includes a small amphitheater for guests to observe bird swimming and a discovery cave for children to closely observe little blue penguins on land and inside nesting burrows. Okay guys, we just finished the La Jolla Aquari Birch Aquarium, so we are on our way back to our hotel. As you can see, my daughter is quite hungry again. <laughs> so she's like, I'm not gonna eat while we're looking at the aquarium. So, but now we're on our way back to the car. She's like, I'm ready to eat. So hope you guys had a great time with us and enjoyed the journey and hope we you know you enjoyed what we shared you know it's a pretty neat aquarium right here in san diego la jolla so whenever you're in san diego feel free to check it out because i'm sure you and your family will love it right honey yes that's right we surely enjoyed this um trip to aquarium so hopefully you guys also not only enjoy the video but check it out if you are just in san diego area bye okay bye abby say bye